Sorry Busana. Uh, if you've been following me, please continue doing so. Um, I'm in Hapa and uh, I decided today to take you to a very, very important site. Actually, it's in the list of the UNESCO's World Heritage Site and that is the Shpaika Stadt. In, in English, this is a warehouse. It's the largest warehouse in the world. It covers about a, a kilometer and a half. And it has got, it covers an area of about 260,000 square meters with about 17 warehouses where they used to store coffee, cocoa, and tea, even carpets. So it's surrounded by canals. Um, used to be transporting the goods to these warehouses and if you look on the other side it's adjacent to the humble harbor on the other side that is uh, at the corner there is a humble harbor so of course uh, very 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 uh, convenient uh, location and uh, this harbor is not just about I mean this warehouse is not about the bricks the red bricks because the architectural design is very very unique and very nice and uh, this place actually is as I said is the world's largest warehouses in the world and so as I'm taking you here I'm going to take you around just to see how they used to store because since a decade ago they don't store in this place anymore so the, the warehouses have, have moved uh, to another area so this place is a tourist attraction. What actually is threatening the, the place here is about the modern buildings that, are, that have uh, come up, even apartments, hotels. Most of the buildings, the old buildings are used for museum. So, and um, it's, it's, quite, it's quite interesting to just walk around. And uh, that is why I decided to bring you people here. I hope you're going to enjoy this place as much as I do. And, um, this place was destroyed during the World War II and most of the buildings were actually uh, destroyed but they've managed to restore the buildings to their natural and original designs to keep the heritage. Okay, so don't forget my, tube, my, my channel is about travel, it's about sight, it's about, um, you know, just, uh, uh, you know, good, good things, uh, 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 you know, that you see as you're traveling. Yeah. The integrity of these warehouses have been threatened by modern housing. Now you you know there are a lot of shops, a lot of offices, and um, many apartments coming up. So, but the warehouses are still intact. The reason why I'm standing on this bridge is to show you this bridge separates the whole city on this side, the whole city. And on the other side is the modern, the modern city. So there are a number of canals connecting these buildings, and today they are used as a tourist, you know, for boats taking tourists around. So I'm going to show you some of these canals and um, and um, some of these uh, buildings, you know, how these warehouses look like. There are many people now these days working here in different uh, with different companies, with the museum, with the restaurant. So it's quite busy as well. Look at this beautiful site here. So you can imagine how big this area is. 
another bridge is all connected with bridges everywhere I told you guys this was the center of trade. This was the center of trade for everything. I mean, coffee, carpets. You can see these fashion carpets. Very expensive uh, carpets here. So guys, these are the canals I'm talking about. So it's a very interesting area to see. But I, as I told you earlier, it's uh, the integrity of this place has been threatened by buildings, modern ones, coming up. But otherwise, a very beautiful place to see. So from here, you're able to see the harbor. Right there. At the end there, the farthest end, is the Humble Harbor. These are all apartments and shops and restaurants, as I said earlier. see the contrast of the old stones the bricks the red bricks this is how modern they've decided to put this city that's why they're calling it the Huffington city the harbor city because it's like a town on its own separated from the main city center of Hamburg That direction is the Washpaikashtat, that's the warehouses. Those are the warehouses. This is how modern this place has become. From the old city. So you can see, we are on the side of the apartments and the, the modern city that they call the Huffington city. And all these are apartments, 
that are very very expensive because they are on the river Elbe and on the other side is actually the Hafen, uh, the, the, the Speicherstadt you can see our red bricked buildings Otherwise, this is what it is now on this side of the half -inch city. So guys, this is all for today. Until next time, bye-bye.